What is up? It's Bob from Home Cook Basics. So today we're gonna to talk about how to cut a bell pepper. So first you're gonna to wanna to wash the pepper. So I like to run it under some water. And the idea of this is we're getting off any pesticides or chemicals from the farm or transport. If you have a vegetable spray, I like to use that. I use a Dr. Bronner's that you can use on vegetables that's diluted. So I give it a good scrub. And you're looking for, you know, lukewarm to cold water when you're washing it. So now that it's washed and clean, I'm going to show you a little trick that I like to do. So first, we're going to cut off the end. Like that. Okay. And then on the end with the stem, this is a weird looking pepper because it kind of stuck in. I don't know if it's going to work on this one. You cut around. And then sometimes you can pull the whole core out right with it. See how that popped right out? And now I got the majority of all the seeds and core right here. You can kind of discard that to the side. Now go ahead and cut it down the middle like that. And then you're going to see it wants to roll open. Now what you're going to do is this inner part, that white part, you're going to cut any of those out. Try to show you better on the camera here. Let's cut this in half, make it a little more manageable. So you're gonna cut out any leftover of that core. Just like that. And then any more seeds in there, just go ahead, give them a knock and get them out. The idea is we're trying to get this flat as possible for when we go ahead and slice it. So once again, go ahead, get that white core out. We did get lucky with cutting that and pulling all the seeds out of that top. All right, so now you just wanna get that laid flat like that. And the flatter you have it, it's easier to cut through this side of the, um, the bell pepper than trying to cut through the skin. I think it's a little, easier to push down on the skin on this side to get it flat because it wants to cup up sometimes in some areas. But anyway, get it flat like that and then you're just going to make your slices. Keep your fingers back. Just like that. You're going for whatever thickness you're going for. If you're using it for a dip or something, you probably want to do it bigger. If you're going to dice it, this is about the size you want to cut it. And once again, with all vegetables, it's really important when you're cutting them to have a sharp knife. All right, now if we're gonna go ahead and dice, you wanna get a nice pile of these. They're already equal because when we cut them and lay them flat, they're the same size. So you get them even like that. Get a good grip on them. And then just dice them. Get near the end, just get your fingers out of there. And you get some nice Dice pepper. So there we got the dice and we got the slice. Don't forget that end is still good. So this end is still perfectly edible. So go ahead and slice that up. If you want slices, if it's too small, you're gonna go ahead and dice. But you can dice that up too or use it as your slices. And that first part too, there's still plenty of pepper left on here. So kind of go around here and slice those off. And then you can use these whatever way you're gonna do them, dice them, slice them, and then you still get that core that you can get rid of. So that's it, how to cut a bell pepper. I hope you see how simple and easy this is. We got diced, we got sliced. Try my little core trick, slicing it around and grabbing it and pulling the whole core out. It's pretty slick and a little bit easier. And I hope you subscribe to my channel and please watch one of my other how to cut videos or check out one of my recipes. There's a lot of good ones on the channel and I hope to see you back and I'll see you next time on Home Cook Basics.